Welcome aboard! In today's video you're going to learn the names of the musical instruments in English. The best about today's lesson is that you're going to learn something new, no matter what your level of English is. If you're interested to know what you see as my background, this is the Royal Albert Hall. It is a large round concert hall in West London and it is one of the United Kingdom's most treasured and distinctive buildings, which was built in the second half of the 19th century in memory of Prince Albert. The capacity of the building is for more than 5,000 people. Now let's start with the instruments. I've divided them into six different categories. Number one, brass instruments. These are the musical instruments that are made of metal. Trumpet, trombone, French horn or just horn, tuba. Category number two, pianos. From smaller to bigger. Keyboard. This is an electric piano. Upright piano and grand piano. Next, woodwind instruments. They are traditionally made of wood and are played by blowing through them. Some of them are flute, oboe, clarinet, saxophone. Moving on to percussion instruments. These are instruments that you play by hitting them with your hand or hands or with a stick. Tambourine. Xylophone. Castanets. These are especially used in Spain by people who dance flamenco. Drum. The sticks that you use to hit the drum are called drumsticks and when we have a set of drums, this set is called drum kit. Another kind of instruments are stringed instruments. A stringed instrument is any musical instrument that you play with your fingers or with a bow. This here is a bow. And the instruments are violin, viola, cello, double bass, guitar, electric guitar. Usually next to the electric guitar we see another piece of equipment that makes the sound louder. This is called amplifier and harp. The last category is other instruments we can think of, like accordion, pipe organ or just organ, and harmonica. At the end of today's video I'm going to give you three extra words related to music, mainly for the pronunciation. The first one is orchestra. Orchestra is a group of people who play various musical instruments together. The orchestra is led by a conductor. In other words, the conductor is the person who stands in front of the orchestra and directs their performance. And the third word is a composer. Composer is the person who writes the music, especially classical music. This is the end of today's video. If you would like to add more words, please do it in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe for the English Top channel and join our community. Thank you so much for watching. See you at the next stop.